Everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Game, and today in this video, I'm going to show you how to create a free Minecraft server using Eternos in Java or Bedrock Edition. And this is actually really easy to do. So let's go on over to my computer, and we can just go to Google.com and type in Eternos, A T E R N O S. Go to the first website here, Eternos Minecraft Servers Free Forever, and then select this, and then go to where it says Play in the bottom right select this and make an account and sign in so you can see i'm signed in, in the upper right now what we want to do is go to where it says servers and then we want to create a server so i do have a server already created right here i want to go to create now under create a server we do have the option for java or bedrock edition so you can choose which one you want so i can go to the bedrock edition and go to create and then we can go to where it says skip now on the left let's go on over to where it says options and then we have some options like to change the game mode if we want to go ahead and just make survival, creative, spectator, etc. The difficulty, force game modes, allow cheats, allow lists, resource pack. We can change the time zone, etc. So we got quite a few different options under here. So once we set that up, we can go back to where's this server. Now just make sure the server version is the same version that you have in Minecraft right here. Otherwise, you're going to have to change the server version or just update Minecraft. So it's the same version. Then we got the port. And now we want to go to where it says address and copy the address. So look at the port number. We'll need that as well. And go to where it says start on the top. Okay, so my server now has been created and it's starting. Let's go to where it says play now. And then go on over to servers. And you can find add servers here on the top or the bottom. So let's go to add servers now and type in a name. Uh, your six. And then go to the server address and press Control V on your keyboard. And then type in the port number right here. So mine was 4270 or 42704. And then we can go to Add Server and you'll see it list right here. And when it loads, we can just go to where it says Play. And then we're going to be in our Minecraft server and it should always exist. So hopefully this video did indeed help you out. If it did, leave it a big thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel down below for more tech videos coming up next on Your 6 Gaming.